LinkedIn a lot, and it's time for one. Um, I want to point out something. So you pay money for LinkedIn, and, and LinkedIn is a valuable service. What I'm bitching at is their customer service is just horrific. It's the worst experience I've ever had in my entire life online. Um, I don't I don't understand why because you'd think someone who raised as much money as they have would be a lot more sensitive and kind and and, and they just I mean they're I get I think they're just overloaded and they're so bad they just can't fix the problem. So if you have if you sign up for an account they guarantee response. Now this is kind of funny. So in mails trusted used to contact anyone on LinkedIn response guaranteed. This implies that the person that you send is going to respond to. Not only that, if they don't respond within seven days, they'll return and give you credit. Okay. So I recently got this, and I might blow it up so it's a little bigger, right? So customer service, dear Michael, your was drawn by was by LinkedIn customer service. It was withdrawn. Okay. And you know, LinkedIn uses proprietary screening technology. Well, what was, so what happened, I'll tell you exactly what happened, right? Proprietary, my ass. You saw the word shut up, which was, which you don't understand the context of, but actually it's a quote from him, right? Great advice. Shut up. Great advice. Putting found on your radar. So he did a talk where he said, shut up. Their stupid, their proprietary screening technology is a word search, and it saw the word shut up and and basically it was withdrawn I don't even think customer service even looked at it it's just automated it's like oh there's there's a word search it's kind of like think of it as um, you know as a, as a as a filter right uh, for kids on your computer right oh I can't send shut up to someone so which I find funny because remember guaranteed response and you got customer service deleting and not sending. Now, let's talk about customer service. So here is, I signed up, and it's funny because this response here um, was September 14th, right, to Mike at Foundups. Now, my original account, which is which is uh, mtrout at foundups.com, has been suspended as 3,000, and I've been trying to get it back, and LinkedIn just won't give it back. Now it's not deleted. It just it just won't give it back to me. And I've and I'll you know I've sent them like why 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 no one responds no nothing just quiet like hey I'm just not gonna talk to Michael Trout right so so let me show you this so basically I said well screw it I'll just start a new account and I'll not only that I'll pay for an executive account so here I am I was like hey I can't I signed up for an account and I can't access it what's the what the heck this is September 14th look at the date here right. So on September 14th, I can't access it, but on September 14th, customer service is basically, you know, responding to the account. So I was like, okay, what happened? Then nothing, right? So then I get a ticket. Uh, you know, oh, we're sorry, we received your message, signed up, you know, we'll get right back to you. Now I have a ticket number, right? So then nothing. So then I sent another email for, you know, can't access LinkedIn is breach of contract. Blah 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 blah. blah. I paid money. Basically, I paid money. I paid ninety nine dollars. Below is proof of payment. Here's my payment. Right? Okay. Here is you know the email that you sent me. I've sent you my email and everything else. Right? And nothing. I get nothing back from them. no reply. No nothing. All right. So then I wait. Right, this is the 20th. Now it's five more days. Okay, final notice. All right, this is my third and final notice. Can't access executive account. Yada yada yada. Here's my bill again. Right. All right, and nothing. I'm running out of time here. So okay. So then finally, it says this refund was issued on on your first uh, request. Please check your credit card. They never sent me an email. You would think they would email say, sorry about this, we've refunded, okay? Um, I have no, they have not, this is the only acknowledgement. I haven't checked my credit card. I don't know if they have or not. So this is the prime example. And then, and this is funny, if I have time here, they send me a customer service. <laughs> That's just too funny. 